quickly. What if we used a fan? How much power would we get out of a fan from uh, just from wind energy or just spinning it? So, the health of a multimeter. Check this out. Multimeter. I'm getting power from it. I'm getting one. So, just a quick turn like this, I get 1.4 volts. Now, what if I put a drill up to this? I'm going to try to spin this here. I'm just going to just touching up against it. That's it. So I get 3.9 full bit. 3.9. That's just for me spinning the drill. I just got the leaves up to it. So imagine having this bolted to the front of your car, I guess with the wind resistance, you're going to get four volts, three volts, three and a half volts from this spinning. This is just a, a radiator fan from uh, Honda Civic Rad. But that's kind of a cool idea. So we just have this fan bolted up. Imagine you had a couple of these bolted up to to uh, the front of a, I don't know, of an RV. You can get some charging power from this. Granted, it's not very much, but I mean, it's kind of cool. So now we got it set on amperage. Let's see how many amps we can get out of this guy. Okay, I'm just gonna spin this. There we go. Not very high. We get about two and a half. So let's see if we could spin this again to get more power. So we got I peaked at 3.8. So we got 3.8 amps and we got 3.8 volts so how is that going to work so with this one fan we got we had about peak of 3.8 or 3.9 volts uh and also we are we peaked at 3.8 or 3.9 for amperage as well so it's 3.8 and to charge our batteries on a car is regularly is 12 volt system. So how will we do this? So we connect three of these together. Three of these together will give us right around 12 volts, really. Three, 3.9, 2.7, nope, it'll be just under 12. And that will be in series. Three of them in series would give us 12 volts. Uh, about 12 amps. Does that math make sense? So with this quick little experiment uh, simulating mounting a couple of these on the front of an RV. So we got an RV project coming up uh, with some power bank systems and solar panels that we plan on installing. I was just thinking wonder if something like this would be able to help charge the battery bank. I don't know, I've never done this. It was just an experiment, something that I just thought of spur of the moment, so I just figured I'd try it out and record it. So let me know you guys if you've tried something like this, whether it works or not, what are your feedbacks. I'd like to hear from you guys. Alright? Thanks for watching.